Mick Schumacher is adding to his family's motor racing legacy as he climbs the European single-seater ladder. After making the jump from F4 to F3 with the renowned Prema power team in 2017, the youngster has remained in the series this season, turning solid points finishes into podiums and, most recently, a victory. That breakthrough win came at Spa-Francorchamps, a circuit synonymous with the Schumacher name, following Michael's F1 debut there in 1991 and his maiden triumph a year later. And for Mick, there is a great pride in continuing the Schumacher story at the legendary track. Well, uh, yeah, I have only good memories of here. I mean, uh, as everybody knows, this is the, let's say, living room of my dad. So uh, I really like and love racing here because I know that he races as well. So for sure, I'm, uh, I'm always happy to, to be here and every year uh, to come back here. Yeah. The young Schumacher also had the opportunity to sample his father's 1994 title-winning Benetton at last year's Belgian Grand Prix, an experience that he savoured and hopes will lead to more outings in the future. The 94 car was for sure uh, stunning to, to have a lap here. Uh, unfortunately, it was only one. It, uh, to be honest, it wasn't that much of a difference from F3. Uh, but as I said, I mean, I only had uh, one lap and the tyres were new. I'd hoped uh, to have a bit more, let's say, mileage on it. Uh, but it wasn't the case, so yeah, unfortunately, it uh, didn't work out there. But hopefully, uh, in the future, I'll be able to drive uh, some other cars. For the time being, Mick's focus is on European F3 and building on his victory at Spa after what had, up until that weekend, been a mixed opening half to the 2018 campaign. Well, uh, the championship is for sure very strong. Uh, we have good drivers, um, which all came from karting. So uh, I know them pretty well. For me, unfortunately, uh, the luck wasn't on my side uh, up to now, so I'm really uh, Hoping that the rest of the season really gets on and uh, gets better. And the luck is a bit on my side and uh, I will fight until uh, I'm, on, uh, I'm on the top step. Longer term, Mick's ultimate ambition remains to follow in his father's footsteps, competing at the highest level as interest grows around his career. The 94 car, uh, was on the, uh, when I drove it, was the F1 weekend. Uh, to be honest, here I'm a bit more focused on what I'm doing. Here on track, so I don't really notice it too much. Uh, but for sure, you know, my, my goal was always uh, F1, and it's still uh, my, my goal. And uh, now, you know, we do one step after the other. So, uh, yeah, I'm looking forward.